Hello and welcome back to Minecraft and Survival episode 4. And oh my, in the last episode we did some amazing discoveries and we did some amazing things. We now have food. Um, it's a cursed fruit. Fruit. Bleh. It's cursed fruit. Um, not the best food sort, but, uh, source, but you know what? I'm happy with it. We can even grow it. So we have these cursed flowers, flowers right here. Which is absolutely amazing. We need uh, we need to plant those when we get home. Now something quite unexpected happened. The main artist for Better End commented on episode two. That's why I haven't said anything about it in episode three because I actually recorded episode three, I think before episode two was out. So that's why I didn't mention it. But the main artist for Better End commented on my episode and they came with some amazing tips and some amazing information i'm so thankful thank you so much and by the way if you are watching this amazing mod it it's amazing and i love it <laughs> i'm gonna read out the comment here it will be on the screen as well for food you can use empty bottles on the glowing shroom light like blocks on the umbrella trees to get juice you can smelt the endstone sand uh, endstone sand for glass, but there's currently a bug where it also consumes the bottle when you drink it. You know what? I'll take it. <laughs> you could go to the biome with the giant blue glowing mushrooms, the sulfur springs, or the mega lake biome to find end fish. That's where the fish are. You can find blossom berries in pink blossoming spires biome, and you can find shadow berries in the shadow forests, which can be cooked and farmed. So that is a bunch of food information right there. Now, hold up. Uh, use empty bottles as a glowing shroom light. Eh? On the umbrella trees. I'm gonna guess that these aren't the umbrella trees. Um, but probably the other big ones um, at home. Or somewhere close. There are two big blue trees. I'm gonna assume it's one of those. Now something else interesting that uh, one of you commented as well. I'll leave it on the screen as well. Is that this biome is home to amber basically so that is interesting now if we look here for the chances for the to spawn is y level 44 i'm on y level 66 so i assume obviously it's gonna generate under the island but that is very very interesting and i would honestly be tempted to First of all, dig down, <laughs> dig down to try and find it, because why? The reason why we want this amber is um, hold on. So amber gem, and then we have the amber block, so we can make the respawn obelisk, which is a replacement for the bit. Oh, hello! You are exactly what we want. <laughs> amber ore. Hello there. I can mine it with a stone pickaxe as well. Okay, get one. And I get three. Awesome. So this biome is home to the amber ore, which is absolutely amazing because we will need that. To make one block, we need one amber gem. And to make one amber gem, we need four raw amber. So that is four times nine. Nine, 18, 27, 36. And that is 36 times four. Um, yeah, I'm not going to continue that math. Feel free. <laughs> Now that is amazing right there. We are making excellent progress. Um, but yeah, so thank you to the main artist for Better End reaching out to me. That is amazing. Great mod you guys are making. Keep up the good work. I cannot recommend this mod enough. Um, but anyways, um, turns out that there is a very important biome over here. So when we were over here in the last episode, we saw a big... Oh, that's a, that's a mushroom. <laughs> We saw a big, like, a big pillar of smoke. And turns out that is one of the places you should be able to get these um, these fish. So I think we definitely need to go and take a look at that before we start heading home. And yes, I can now run when I walk because I now have food, even though it can be a little bit disorientating. <laughs> um, but yes, let us go over... That was very disorientating. I went the complete wrong way. I'm pretty sure this is the way. Um, can we see any ember on the side? 
I see something else. Hold up, I see something else. I see another ore that I really, really want, I think. Hold up. I do actually see some ember ore there as well. Now, I just don't want to get hit off from the back here and lose everything. That would be terrible. But on the next, like, down there is another type of ore. That is, that's the smoke, by the way. We'll take a look at it in just a moment. Um, definitely gonna keep my eyes out for that amber stuff. Right here. Right here. And the ore. I assume I can break with my pickaxe. And the shot. Yes. Wait, hold up. Hold up. Hold up. And the shot. Okay, that's, that's interesting. So... If we go here, that is what I wanted. This is the ender dust. I believe this is what I needed for the end for dummies. Uh, the ender dust, the ender shot right here. I needed that. Or an ender pearl, I believe. But we could use a hammer to get the end dust. But I think we could do other. Can we do other stuff as well? Uh, oh. Oh, wait. Oh, okay. <laughs> uh, so that is apparently how we get eternal crystals, which we use in the respawn obelisk. Oh my, this is this is a lot to to process. Um Okay, Th this is a this is a lot to process. <laughs> I was about to eat this church fruit here, but I don't think it's a good idea doing it right next to the edge. Um let's let's get a little bit closer to the mainland before we eat one of those. That's a that's a thing to remember as well. Right here should be good. Yeah, we're good. We're good. All right, let's head to this other biome over here. I'm just keeping my eye out for potential amber on the side of the walls here because I need that. Um, but yeah, I guess we'll have to come back to it to see if we can potentially do a whole mining session. But anyways, these are the, I guess, geysers? Geysers. Yep, that, that's, that's, a, that's a new biome right here. I also saw that. I don't know if that is the umbrella mushrooms they were talking about, but I guess we'll have to see. Um, okay, what do we have here? Sulfuric rock. Brimstone. Okay. Brimstone, brimstone. All of this is brimstone. Oh, I see fish! Now, does this water hurt you? No. Okay, but I assume the water up there will. <laughs> Um, okay, hold up, going down here. Okay, so what do we have? We have, I would call that a jellyfish. Oh, ow, ow, that, hmm. That hurt. <laughs> that hurt. Oh, I don't get anything from killing them? Oh, wait, that one did. Gelatine, interesting. What is this? Oh, wait, 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 air, 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 <laughs> air, food, health. Okay, Gelatin, what is this used to? Shadow berry jelly. Ah, interesting. I doubt it, I could just eat it just like that. Um, but wait, what was the, what was the inside for, what, of this thing? Hold up. All right, what do we have here? I'm kind of scared of going into that, not gonna lie. I think I'd rather climb and see where that takes us than, um... Oh no, did I look at any man? No, I think I'm good. I'd rather climb this thing and see what's at the top of it, if I can climb it. Because I'm intrigued. <laughs> what's that? I didn't kill this. And fish! Another end fish. What on? Are these guys? Are these guys just like the ultimate food source? Because <laughs> it kind of looks like it. Not gonna lie. Ow! Oh, what? What was that? I assume that was like the jellyfish doing something. Ow! Okay. Be careful. Ow! Okay. 
<laughs> I need to be careful not to die here. Um. Oh, this is so cool. This is so. Oh, there it is. Hey, and the fish. Bye, and the fish. Actually, you know what? That's he's kind of cute. <laughs> so we can cook this and then we can eat it. That's cool. Bye now. Um, I really want to get all the way up here though, but I don't know if I'm directly being prevented because of these. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I really want to go to the top of this thing, but I think I think I need to go down and heal first. I've given up trying to climb it. I'm just gonna get enough to make it a whole pillar to get up there. I think that's gonna be the easiest for me. That way, those jellyfish won't be able to reach me. All right, here we go again. This time, I'm climbing the whole thing. Um, I don't want to waste these blocks, though. All right, getting close to the top. This is gonna be interesting. Hopefully, I don't die. Um, I see. Mm hmm. I don't know. The thing is, I don't know if it's the jellyfish or if it's just, I guess, heat. It could be just the heat or the sheer amount of jellyfish up there. Because there is a lot. Including the fish. Oh my. Hmm. Like, look at the amount of fish here. I need this food. <laughs> Right, I'm gonna attempt land here, kill the jellyfish. If I get pushed down again, I'm gonna move on. The sounds here are cool though. All right. Jelly, you're dead. Okay. Why can I, I just can't jump. Why? Okay. Eh? Okay, I think it is the sheer amount of jellyfish up there keeping me from actually getting up there. Which is fine. I guess it's just good to know that I can actually come to these and just get a bunch of fish. Ow. Wait, so for crystal. Oh, wait, hold up. Sulfur crystal can be used to get gunpowder. Interesting. Didn't know I could get that, but yeah, I think it's just a sheer amount of, um... Ow. Yeah. <laughs> Of jellyfish up there hindering my advance. So I think um, um, I think I'm gonna head down now. Uh, we do have oh no a lot of in the middle there I really want to go there and see if there's fish over there and just to take a look in general So let's head over there. I'll meet you there <laughs> Maybe another time when I'm a little bit braver we can actually hello We could actually go in here um, Let me swim in there and see what's at the bottom. I would love to see what's at the bottom of that, but right now that kind of spooks me and also I do not have the air to do it. <laughs> so that's not happening right now. This biome does look amazing though. Like it looks really, really cool. Gotta be careful where I look because of the Enderman, but <laughs> this place looks amazing. It also seems like we have a high concentrated amount of the stone that replaces, well, stone. Um, so that is very good to know if we need a large quantity of it, that we can come here and potentially get a lot of it. Now, we have a lot of these, like, I wouldn't call this a spring, but, well, water area. The question is if we have fish in them or if they're just empty. Nope, there's fish, all right. Including jellyfish. <laughs> you know what? I need I need food, and I'm sure they will probably respawn eventually. So, um, it's fine. <laughs> it's fine. We have 13 ant fish. Hopefully, pretty good. Maybe we'll find other biomes where we can get fish from as well. This is a lot of. Oh dear me. Okay, that scared me. <laughs> This is a lot of fish right here, but this is very good for us because that will help us when potentially we don't maybe have flowers there and then or the first fruits to eat. Um, so I'm just getting a bunch of these uh, just to try them and also just to have them because we need a lot of food. 
a Hydralux. That's the first time I've seen one. Um, but... Okay, now it's just... It's just gone. Okay. Um, I didn't punch it or anything. I simply touched it and it was gone. Not weird at all. Okay, don't know if that's a bug or not. Alright, guys. I think this is what I'm gonna do. I'm going to pause the video right here. I'm going to go back home. And then we will be placing our tourist flower flowers. We will be basically starting our tourist fruit farm. We will get this fish cooked up. We will organize the inventory and such. And then we will also... Um, what was the other thing? Oh yeah, we'll cook up some glass and we'll try those uh, trees to see if we can get some of that uh, tree juice or whatever it was. I don't remember now. I'll need to double check. Um, but yeah, that's the plan. I'll see you back home. And we are back. Yes, finally. <laughs> back home. It's been a while since we've been here. Oh yeah, I forgot we made this little bit of uh, an upgrade. Alright, I need to... Clean up my inventory, and by cleaning up, I mean pretty much just dump everything in here. <laughs> Alright, we gotta cook the the, uh, the end fish here. We have the tourist flower right here. Uh, the sofa we're not gonna, not gonna need right now. Um, I'm gonna do that though, because that's that's a little bit nicer than... Well, this is fine, but yeah, I want, I want that in there. Um, I guess we can... Power on the pedestal. Maybe we can add something to the pedestal. You know what? Our first pickaxe. Our first pickaxe of the series. How about that? Um, all right. So I'm gonna start with eight. I don't wanna see. All right. Cool. So uh, clearly, this is umbrella tree logs and tree box. So I need to figure out exactly what it is I need to right click a bottle with. But before we do that, I don't have a shovel. But before we do that, I need some of this end sand stone. End stone dust. There we go. Let me get a little bit of this. All right, our cooked end fish has finished. I will try and eat that when the opportunity arises. I'm currently smelting some end stone dust. While it does that, we can go ahead and plant these uh, cursed flowers right here. I think we are going to plant them probably over here somewhere. I think just like that. I don't think we need to stack them or anything. So I think maybe a little bit of a pattern just to, I don't know, do something. <laughs> we have a lot of them, which is good. So I'm going to place these. There we go. Hopefully we'll get more in the future. Hopefully these will then um, start growing. Now, according to the, um, the artist for a better end, said... Uh, umbrella tree glowing mushroom like it, you saw the comment um, question is exactly what I'm gonna go ahead and assume it is those the purple blocks because nothing else is really glow glowing so I feel like that is what it is indeed it is and then it stops glowing empty for the umbrella tree cluster Question is then, is that going to refill itself? But that is very, very interesting. That is a very, very... Ow. Is that a... Is it decaying or is that an enderman walking around? I'm sure I saw blocks starting to disappear. I don't know. Um, but... This is now Umbrella Cluster Juice. Now, how much does this give? It doesn't get consumed. At all. Okay, so that that's that's clearly a bug that, of course, is going to get fixed. Um, I don't know if it's supposed to give any, like, food or hunger. I assume it will. Eventually, but currently it doesn't even get um, gets consumed. So that's that's interesting. Um, I'll keep I'll keep uh, I'll keep these on me um, because I assume that's gonna get fixed soon, hopefully. Um, but yeah, that's that's that. Oh, okay, yeah, it's 
they're growing fast. Oh my. Well, I'm gonna wait to, until I'm a little bit more hungry. And then I'm gonna eat this cooked um, cooked end fish. Just gonna get my hunger down to four hunger bars. And I, there we go. I can't imagine this taking more than, giving more than two meat pups. We'll see. My guess is two. Three. That's pretty good, actually. That's pretty good. I'd consider it to be a little less because the fish wasn't that big. But you know what? I'll take it. No pretty stuff with a fruit. <laughs> That's then gonna teleport us outside. That's cool. I'm gonna cook the rest of these up. And I'm gonna call this an episode right here. So, we did some pretty good progress. We now have a farm of tourist fruit growing. We have learned that we can get some sort of juice. Um, again, that bug just needs to get fixed. Hopefully that will be another food source as well. And um, yeah, we discovered cooked end fish and very importantly as well, we figured out how to get ender shards and also uh, raw amber. We need more amber. Um, but for right now, I think main priority is keep exploring. We need to find some end city so we can get some iron and stuff like that. Hopefully also some armor. But also we are still missing, I believe a bunch of biomes because we still need these crystal shards and stuff. So yeah, probably more exploring, but anyways, Regardless of that, I hope you have enjoyed this episode. If you did, be sure to leave a like and subscribe if you haven't done so yet. And I hope to see you in the next one, which will probably contain more exploring or something else. Maybe we need to start doing some building. Let me know down in the comments below. I did actually get a suggestion to do like a wizard tower thing. Um, so maybe we'll be, we will do, be doing some building in the next episode. I don't know yet. Um, I'm going to decide. <laughs> leave your suggestions down below in the comments. But regardless, it's going to be exploring this awesome mod. And uh, yeah, that's going to be it for this one. Hope you enjoyed it. I hope to see you in the next one. Have a wonderful day and goodbye. This, this feels good having these fish right here.